Hello my soccer universe for a rare double unpacking video. Two pink jerseys and no, none is Palermo. No Palermo in this one, but it will be two Italian pink jerseys that I'm really, really excited about. For the first one, I almost forgot that I have not shown it in a video because I've been wearing it already because I was so happy to find that one. Remember back in ahead of the Euros I had this big video where I ordered lots of scarves from vintage football area. There was also a Dutch jersey thrown in for good measure and there was another jersey thrown in that I saw at the last second and it was not necessary in the budget. However, you know, I made nice eyes to my wife to say, you know, <laughs> This is really the jersey I've been looking for the whole season on sale. Couldn't get it at the club store because shipping would have been way too expensive that I can justify it. It was already sold out everywhere else. And here I have it even below the price because of a small, small flaw. A flaw that I cannot really make out anymore. So I had to get it. And it's one of those jerseys that probably even three years ago I would have hated. On the other side, I really like the way it is. It is something completely different. So let me show you the first pink jersey. Although a whole lot more colors on there, but I think pink is the main color. It is of course Milan's third jersey from the past season. Yeah, it has a lot of colors. I mean, this is pink, purplish. There's a whole lot of pink in the Milan logo. Then it goes into violet and then there's even a little bit green thrown in. And then there's a little bit more hot pink here on the corners. It's an outstanding jersey. It's absolutely an outstanding jersey. Is it beautiful? Well, this is one of those where you either love it or hate it. I very early on fell on the love it side. The only thing I didn't love is this was worn with blue pants. I mean, I should not wear blue pants. But other than that, I really love this one from the get-go. What's even cooler is I see this jersey relatively regularly. You know, when I pick up my older daughter from her school, there are kids walking around with this one. Boys. Yes, boys. This is a really popular jersey. It was popular with me. I remember when we were in Venice, I saw this one. It cost over 100 euros. Um, I saw a long sleeve version at the Milan store that would have cost 109 but then 25 shipping are you crazy are you crazy milan free shipping from 180 on and you don't even have the jerseys to back that up that one is absolutely nuts i have to say i really would like to order from the official club store but that shipping cost is way too high and i also have to say you know you don't need to choose express shipping give the option to have a cheaper shipping and I would order more often from you. It has a f slight blemish that I cannot even make out. It's somewhere around the sponsor. There's a teeny little pull, but you don't really make it out. The one thing I have to say though, Puma, what you didn't do well is the back. I know unicolored back, but what is this? I think if you have a white number, I mean, we see already a sponsor here, you could have gone with the whole thing in the same maybe for the player version make it a blank back or whatever but not for this one not for this one i think there there they dropped the ball but from the front this is a really really great shirt absolutely love it as i said i've been very frequently my girls love it my wife loves it and i got the side eye from my aunt my dear aunt she couldn't believe that i'm wearing a color like this so of course I have also the other one, this is not new, but you know, two out of the four that were released, five, I really love those fourth jerseys, unlikely that I will get them relatively soon. The home jersey I probably can forego, but those two here were really, really nice. Okay, now for the other pink jersey. This one here I paid, I think, 89, I want to say, yeah, it's not cheap, but you know, it was a jersey I wanted to have, I knew I will have to pay up for it, so there you go. This one here that I have. I also knew I will not get really cheap, especially if I want to get it in a good condition. And I two times almost had it. It just sold under my nose on Wilhelm. This time on Wilhelm, I knew I had to be fast. The price was actually high enough that it will not get sold under my nose. I think originally the, the seller wanted to have 70. He lowered the price to 55, at which point I asked him, can you please reserve it until the end of the month when I get my salary? I will buy it for sure. He was a little bit hesitating on that one, but in the end he agreed to it. As soon as I had my salary, I bought it. He sent it the same day and it took over a week to arrive here. 
The mail in summer here in Austria is horrific. This cannot be. Just from Vienna to here, it's usually a two day shipping, not eight days. You know, and I'm not counting business days. However, the jersey is well worth it. This is an absolute classic, one of the most famous pink jerseys. And I always kind of wanted to have it. Although I remember when this was released, not that crazy about it. Meanwhile, I recognize it, modern classic. It's the 1516 Juve away jersey, the first one by Adidas. This crazy design. I know Juve in pink is actually a proper color because originally Juve were playing in pink, adding this hot pink stripe with the white and here. That was the one thing that had me a little bit puzzled. But this jersey stood the test of time. And I actually love that we have a little bit black on here. We have the white here, so we have the club's colors, the Jeep logo, although it's placed on it fits within this whole thing quite nicely. Still the old Juve crest. We had still two years to go to the J and I still want to have a Juve jersey with a J. I think this is one thing that I have now. Not on the front burner, but you know, mid, mid to back burner in a way. If there's a nice Juve jersey with a J, I probably will get it. Um, but yeah, also the first time that they had the three stars because under Nike, you know, they still work technically under 30 titles because of the two that they were stripped of them now they had it for sure adidas added these on of course social media made this one super 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 famous but i still think it is a really outstanding shirt this is adidas at its best and i said it many times i actually love this shirt template with this with the sleeves that are kind of a little bit extra then also on the bottom, you get a little bit extra here. You have an extra white. And there's also a really interesting pattern, which I would assume is um, motivated by the stadium. I don't know if you see this print here and there's a J in the middle, which is of course not the UV logo, uh, the modern one. Well, that's actually really, really cool. No, I don't have a player on the back. Who would be obvious ones? Yana Borucci, Chiellini, potentially Pogba or whatever. I don't care, I think I want to keep it this way. What I would like to add though is the Scudetto and potentially a Cocarda if I can find it. This is something I would like to add to this jersey to just make it a little bit more special now that I have the option to do so. This would be fun to do so. Yes, I paid overall 60 for this one. Probably could have gotten it cheaper somewhere else but you know this is XL, this is my size. I actually can wear this jersey and that actually counts a lot to me absolutely love this jersey and there you have it two pink beauties and none of it is palermo which i'm wearing of course right now yes when i got this one i like this one better than the home jersey that they were selling under copper but i probably should have gotten the home jersey as well just because you know in any case i have two pinkish jersey i mean the Juve jersey is definitely pink and adds hot pink the milan jersey Multicolored is probably the best way to say it and you know <laughs> is it really pink what color is it whatever in any case it's an outstanding shirt not a Milan shirt however they did well in the Champions League whenever they were wearing this one so really cool really cool stuff with that very pleased with these two jerseys I gotta say let me know what you think about these in the thumbs up if you enjoyed this video I'll talk to you soon about more things in my soccer universe bye Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you may enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell icon so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye!